It's Friday, March 14, 2008, and you're watching The Ointment. I'm Steve Tatum, your host, and today is National Pie Day in honor of Albert Einstein's birthday. So enjoy yourself a piping hot slice of physics. Normally on Fridays here on the show, I do my weekend review wrap up, but this has been a weird week on the show. I did a fake commercial, I did something else, and then uh, Mary and I were giggling through the show yesterday. So I thought I'd make today's show an extra long news quiz to see if you've been paying attention attention to what happened this week in the news. So get your pencils ready. Here it goes. Question number one, Warren Buffett has been named the wealthiest man on the planet, but he said that not even he would waste his money on A, a new house, B, untested investments, C, double latte at Starbucks, or D, Ashley Dupree. Question number two, scientists have discovered an ingredient in popcorn causes lung disease. So now movie theaters will be serving their popcorn with A, warnings, B, an iron lung, C, canaries, or D, extra salt, so you can't taste the death. Question number three, Congress this week failed to override President Bush's veto of a bill outlawing waterboarding because A, Torture is what makes this country so great. B, a little water never hurt anybody. C, it's not torture when it's outsourced. Or D, you think that's torture? Try sitting through one of these hearings. Question number four, prostitute Ashley Dupree, who took down, so to speak, Governor Elliot Spitzer this week said, she doesn't want to be thought of as a monster. She prefers to be thought of as A, a government consultant, B, a goodwill ambassador, C, a biochemical engineer, or D, Madame Curie. And finally, question number five, Hillary Clinton favors a primary do-over vote in the state of Michigan as long as A, they vote until she's likable, B, she wins, C, nobody else is on the ballot, or D, if she does lose, she can blame it on the fact that she's white. That's the ointment for another week. Thanks for tuning in. I'm Steve Tatum, and that's news. Have a great weekend, everybody.